right, guys. So I'm reading an article from page six about Tia Mari in her divorce from Corey Hart Harding. And she's talking about how, you know, we worry about our family, friends. It's about self-love. That was the moment she realized she wanted a divorce. And they have a picture of her with Corey angled in on her from a wine, sharing a wine, some wine. He has his wine glass up. She has her wine glass up. Corey's looking like a complete simp. Guys, when she say I'm focusing on me, I want some self-love, my happiness, she talking about all them dicks that's not Corey Hardick. She wants happy dicks. She wants strange dicks. That's what it is, guys. That's what she's come to realize. She wants a whole bunch of dicks penetrating those butt cheeks, penetrating her insides from the side, from the back. She wants a, 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 a penis attack. That's what they mean, guys. When it's about their happiness, she's saying, I want dick galore and I don't want to be married anymore, bro. That's what it means. Her happiness, she has her kids. Guys, remember this. They're going to get the kids. They're going to establish the family with you. They're going to have the in-laws and everybody and then the light bulb is going to go off in their heads. Ooh, I need to be fucked by a whole bunch of penises. This is egregious. I need it. I need all them dicks in me. She gonna bait and switch your ass, pull the rug from underneath you. You're gonna be like, where did this come from? As Coach Greg Adams says, she's planning out the divorce when she gets married with you. You motherfuckers still wanna marry these baiting and switching shrews. So, continue to do that shit. I'm not feeling sorry for you. 